the world stood on the brink of destruction. The year was 1914, and World War I, a conflict like no other, was about to unfold. As the dawn of the 20th century broke, the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand of Austria-Hungary by a Serbian nationalist was the spark that ignited a powder keg of escalating tensions among the world powers. In the heart of Europe, a complex web of alliances had been spun. The great nations, intoxicated by power and ambition, were drawn into a dangerous dance of diplomacy and deterrence. Germany, Austria-Hungary and the Ottoman Empire, the Central Powers, stood against the Allies, France, Russia and the United Kingdom. The stage was set for a global conflict of unprecedented scale and devastation. The fuse was lit, and the world was on a path to war. A war that would forever change the course of history and leave echoes of valor on forgotten front lines. In the summer of 1914 the world powers declared war, plunging the globe into a conflict of unprecedented scale. The tension that had been building up among the world's superpowers finally reached a boiling point. It was a time of alliances and divisions, a time when the world was split into two great factions, the Central Powers and the Allied Forces. The early stage of the war saw the spread of conflict far and wide. From the Western Front to the distant corners of the globe, no land was spared. The war was not just a European affair, it was a global catastrophe. Amid the chaos, a new form of warfare emerged, trench warfare. It was a grim and gruesome reality of the Great War. Soldiers huddled in deep trenches in conditions that were far from humane, waiting for their turn to go over the top. And then, there were the forgotten front lines. The Eastern Front, where the Russian Empire battled against the Central Powers, was a theater of war that saw some of the most brutal fighting. The Italian Front too was a crucial yet overlooked battleground, where the Italians fought against Austro-Hungarian forces amidst the rugged terrain of the Alps. As the war raged on, the world map was being redrawn, and the human cost was catastrophic. By 1917, the war was in its fourth year, and the tides were beginning to turn. The echoes of valor were becoming more pronounced as the forgotten front lines came to the fore. The entry of the United States into the conflict marked a significant shift. Until then the war had been largely a European affair, but now it had truly become a world war. The American soldiers, fresh and eager, brought with them a new energy and a vast resource of industrial power. The balance, which had been teetering on the brink, began to tilt. The central powers were being squeezed from all sides. During this period, one of the most significant battles unfolded. The Battle of Passchendaele. Also known as the Third Battle of Ypres, it was a campaign of the First World War, fought by the Allies against the German Empire. The battle was marked by heavy rains, transforming the battlefield into a quagmire that swallowed men, horses and tanks alike. Despite the horrific conditions, the battle marked a strategic victory for the Allies. Meanwhile in the East, the Russian Revolution was brewing. The Tsar was overthrown, and Russia was on the brink of civil war. This revolution would lead to Russia's withdrawal from the war, sending shockwaves through the Allied forces. The war was nearing its end, but the impact on the world was far from over. In November 1918 the guns finally fell silent. The war was over but its echoes would reverberate for decades to come. The Treaty of Versailles, signed in June 1919, marked the formal end of the war. It was more than a peace agreement. It was a seismic shift that redrew national boundaries, reshaping the global map in ways that continue to influence geopolitics today. Countries were born, others disappeared, and many found their borders dramatically altered. The world had changed and the echoes of these changes still resonate. But the treaty was not just about land. It was about people. It was about societies grappling with the immense human cost of the war. Millions had lost their lives. Millions more were left scarred, physically and mentally by the horrors they had witnessed. The war had taken a toll not just on the soldiers but also on those they left behind. Families were shattered, communities devastated and societies were left to pick up the pieces. The war also brought about profound social and political changes. Empires crumbled, monarchies fell, and new ideologies emerged. Women, having taken on roles traditionally held by men during the war years, started demanding more rights, leading to suffrage movements in many countries. The war had acted as a catalyst, accelerating changes that were already simmering beneath the surface of societies. And then, there were the psychological impacts. The trauma of the war left deep scars on those who survived. Shell shock, as it was then known, is now recognized as post-traumatic stress disorder. 
The psychological toll of the war was immense, and it forever changed our understanding of the human mind and its resilience. World War I was a turning point in human history, a conflict that redefined the world and left a legacy that continues to shape our present. From the ashes of the war, a new world emerged, carrying with it the echoes of a past filled with valor and horror, lessons learned, and a future forever altered by the echoes of the forgotten front lines. The echoes of World War I still reverberate today, a stark reminder of the devastating impact of global conflict. This monumental event sparked by a complex web of alliances, rivalries, and tensions erupted into a war like no other. It was a war that saw the emergence of forgotten front lines, places where valor was displayed in its rawest form yet often overlooked in the annals of history. The consequences of this war were far-reaching, reshaping political landscapes, societies, and economies. It brought about significant advancements in technology and warfare, yet at the same time, it unveiled the horrors of mechanized combat. Amidst the rubble and ruin, heroes were forged and legends born. These echoes, these reflections of a past marred by conflict serve as poignant reminders of the courage and sacrifice of those who fought in the face of adversity. As we remember World War I, we acknowledge the courage and sacrifice of those who fought and we commit ourselves to the pursuit of peace.